Hi right, guys, welcome back to Mass Dickhead 2, where I'm a dickhead. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Alright, let's go, let's go talk to Rex. Uh, we got one more thing here. Tachanka is short, uh, if I remember, so, yeah. I was get our dial again. You just can't help making trouble. No one has killed a maw since my turn in the right. Next, you'll tell me he's a Quint and craps dark matter. Guess that's what it takes to replace me. You are Erdnot Grunt. Welcome. Uh... I think there's nothing else here, really. Sounds like you've got big changes ahead. We're making it. It's a yeah, new day for we did all this. We shall. I need to go. We'll go over this another Watch time. Watch yourself, Shepard. Tuchanka isn't safe and homey like Pharaoh. Pharaohs and Ilos. Well, we can now kind of go around. Oh, dude, we can watch a fight? Fuck Put yeah. Down some real human. Oh, let's, let's go. Okay, so do we want to uh, bet on White Blue Hope or the Red Brown Thunder? I'm going to bet on the red one. Yeah, come on, red one. Kick his ass. Fuck. All right, we lost. Watch it, human. All right, talk to Master Chef Scout. What do you want, human? Rex told me to be polite. He didn't say you were going to talk to me. I'm looking for a Solarian. The Blood Pack captured him, and he was last seen around here. I heard about that Solarian, poor bastard. If it's Blood Pack, then Clan Warlock has him. Sent one of my scouts to check it out, but he never reported back. Guess they got him, too. Chief told me to give you one of the trucks. Just follow the highway to Warlock's base if you've got the quads to deal with him in the Blood Pack. What can you tell me about Clan Warlock's base? Last I heard, the clan was holed up in an old hospital. I haven't seen it, though. I've only seen Clan Warlock from a distance. If I'd gotten closer, I'd have taken a shot. You get inside, though, bring a big gun. Warlock's base is crawling with blood pack. That doesn't sound too defensible. Why'd they hole up there? Any hospital on Tachanka has to be built well enough to withstand a bunch of enraged Krogan. When an injury forces us to switch over to secondary organs, things get messy. Higher thought processes don't always transition properly. Blood rage, they call it. Any idea what they're doing with the Solarian? I assume they wanted to torture him. You don't take somebody home just to kill them. It's messy. Maybe he pissed off the blood pack, and they brought him here for special treatment. No skin off my hump what they'd do with him. One less alien on Tachanka. You don't seem to have much love lost for aliens. Don't get your quads in a twist. If I was going to kill you, you'd know it. Rex believes we need to unite the Krogan people. I don't think we can do that with off-worlders interfering, but it's not my call. What's Clan Warlock's reputation, and how are they involved with the Blood Pack? Tough humps, and they're not friendly like we are. You ever run into the Blood Pack? Mercenary gang. Clan Warlock started it, one of the only gangs with an off-world presence. They're fanatics, totally devoted to Warlock Gold. Whatever they did with your Solarian, Gold's behind it. What makes Gold so special? He's got two children. One of them is a girl. Some people think he's got a destiny. Not me. I had a cousin who won 20 consecutive games of Quasar. Lucky bastard. I'd ask my cousin for a loan, but I wouldn't swear allegiance to him. Luck. That's all it is. Same for Gold. But the Blood Pack has non-Krogan members. Like Vorcha. Ha! <laughs> the Vorcha. They're just like the Varen. Only they can use guns and don't crap on the floor as often. The Krogan are the only real members of the Blood Pack. Anyone else is just there to soak enemy fire. I guess this is Borden's one. So we'll just do that then. Yeah, Morden. All right, we'll bring along Grunt, I guess. So I guess he, yeah, he's loyal now. So might as well do it. Uh, let's see what we got here. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna save for a Solarian Scientist for him. I'm glad I did do uh, a lot of stuff I did do there. Morden has Locust SMG, I think. Tempest is good for him because he doesn't get the the recoil. I don't know. Who cares? Fuck, we're in the Mako again? God, I'm already sick of the Mako. No, I'm just joking. Obviously, clearly not the Mako. I guess they really like this cutscene. Because it's the exact same one. This is the only two things we have to do here, so I might as well do it. By the way, we're bringing him along because of his witty commentary for this place. What do we, get? Oh, we just chose weapons. Why do we get another weapons locker? Whatever. Alright, time to put on my useless disruptor ammo for this situation. I mean, you, you never know. You gotta be ready for death on this planet. Get ready to fight. Actually, wait, what, what kind of ammo? So he's got that gun. Let's bring this guy to the shotgun. Actually, honestly, he should basically use that gun, actually, now I think about it. Because we're not going to be... Yeah, yeah, you, you got him. You got him, Grant. T that's, that's tank bread for you. A little bit, little bit off. That one is. Oh, at least he's got barrier now. Why is this the most effective weapon I have against armor all of a sudden? Because the pistol doesn't do it. Pistol's accurate, but it's not necessarily, like, the best damage. Or DPS, you know? I found this gun to just do more DPS. Which is, uh, really random, I know. It, it just feels that way, you know? Yeah, what are, what are we up to now? Fuck, I missed. The Blood Pack Boom Squad. Headshot. What happened to the other guy? Actually, where did he even go? There was two of them. Did he fuck off? Maybe I killed one, I don't know. Maybe he ran away. I guess we'll just stay here. <laughs> Pretty sure I hit him. Ah, uh, so. Alright, I think we're gonna go to my other gun. I may have missed him. But I was I was told they'd cover. They seem to have a thing for me, which is why I always stand at the back. Like even the AI understands. If they take me out, then they're then the game's over. Please. Alright. Oh, another medkit, nice. Why does he keep yelling like every ten seconds I am Krogan? I mean we know this. Nothing can hurt me. Oh, that's different. At least he said something else. You know, then, then he can't complain. Alright, he has his like, little purple shield up. I am 
I'm gonna deal with this guy. Oh, okay, he just blew up, alright. This didn't really, really helps on this planet, because everything has armor and not a... You guys have some massive regen, but I have a Krogan, which is also massive regen. Fuck, you're not allowed up here. You know, I haven't really gotten ammo in like the last little bit. It's just depending upon me to like pick it up from these assholes. This is what I mean, it always comes back to the fucking, uh, uh, like, the the heat sink stuff. Broken hospital, sturdy, built to withstand punishment. Dead human body. That body, human. Need to take a look. Sores, tumors, ligatures showing restraint at wrists and ankles. Track marks for repeated injection sites. Test subject, victim of experimentation. Any idea whether what they gave him is contagious? No, appears to be cultivation of cancerous cells, aggravated by torture, malnourishment, not a virus. Probably testing vectors to attack genophage. Primary goal, not infection of humans. Humans useful as test subjects, genetically diverse, enables exploration of treatment modalities. Experimenting on humans? That kind of crap is what makes Cerberus start to seem like a good idea. Never used humans myself. Disgusting, unethical, sloppy. Used by brute force researchers, not thinkers. No place in proper science. Krogan use of humans, unsurprising. I imagine you had to do some live subject testing while developing the new genophage. No, unnecessary. Limited tests to simulations, corpses, clone tissue samples. High level tests on Varan. No tests on species with members capable of calculus. Simple rule, never broke it. Wouldn't something native to Tachanka work better? Varan, maybe? Yes, human experiments strictly high level, concept testing. Native to Chanka fauna likely used later in development stages. Wise to delay use of Varan until necessary. Powerful bite. What can you tell about their experiments from looking at the body? Position of tumors suggests deliberate mutation of adrenal pineal glands, modifying hormone levels, counterattack on glands hit by genophage. Clever. Do you think they're close to curing the genophage? Can't say. Need more data. Conceptually sound, though. Genophage alters hormone levels, could repair damage with hormonal counterattack. How are humans more genetically diverse? More variable. Peaks and valleys, mutations, adaptations, far beyond other life. Makes humans useful test subjects. Larger reactions to smaller stimuli. I know we can look much different from each other, but Asari have a wide range of skin tones. No, ignore superficial appearance, down to genetic code. Biotic abilities, intelligence levels. Can look at random Asari, Krogan, make reasonable guess. Humans, too variable to judge. Outliers in all species, of course. Geniuses, idiots. But human probability curve offers greater overall variety. Come on, we still need to find Nail. Agreed. Alright. Humans have a better genetic variability, huh? The more you know. I mean, that kind of makes sense. Like, Shepard is like super leader or whatever. I am the speaker for Clan Werelock, Offworlders. You have shed our blood. By right, you should be dead already. But Werelock Gold, the Chief of Chiefs, has ordered that you be given leave to flee and spread the message of our coming. If I flee, I might trip over the dozen Krogan I killed to get here. I think I'll take my chances. You killed our youngest and weakest human. They were not worthy of remaining near our glorious work. Inside! You will find only hardened, blood-packed veterans, tempered by savagery and war, and dedicated to one goal. The Salarian will cure the genophage, and Clan Warlock will spread across the galaxy in a sea of blood. Appears they discovered Malin's work. Unfortunate. If you care about the future of Clan Warlock, you'll hand over Malin. Now. When we cure the genophage, Warlock Gold will rule all Krogan. The Krogan Rebellion... You talk too much. 
See? The human cannot hit a simple target. Too late, now you're dead. Oh, they're flanking us. Oh, I don't have any more fucking weapons here. Because it doesn't give me any frickin' ammo. Okay, well, let's go to the pistol at least. That should be slightly more effective against his HP. I don't know why the guy with the shotgun is right here with me, though. He's used to 100 credits I've ever earned. See, right now it seems to be kind of giving me ammo based upon RNG and nothing else. Well, at least I have three shots with this thing now. Alright. What do I mean? It's like, oh, you don't get to use your fucking... your favorite guns to use the fucking shitty SMG. For a year and a half. That's probably why the Locust is probably superior. Through there. Can smell antiseptic, hint of dead flesh. Just get us there. I thought, I thought, I thought, I thought you'd have more to say about uh, Tachanka. I figured this was the mission for uh, Grunt to come with us. Alright. Salvage. Active console may contain useful data. One moment. Genetic sequences. Hormone mutagens is still steady. Protein chains. Live tissue. Clone tissue. Very thorough. Standard treatment vectors. Avoiding scorched earth immunosuppressants to alter hormone levels. Good. <laughs> Hate to see that. Most people wouldn't be so casual about developing a sterility plague, Borden. Not developing. Modifying. Much more difficult. Working within confines of existing genophage. A hundred times the complexity. Errors unacceptable. Could cause total sterility. Malignant tumors. Could even reduce effectiveness. Worse than doing nothing. Had to keep Krogan population stable. One in one thousand. Perfect target, optimal growth. Like gardening. You're saying you were working just as hard to keep their population from falling? Yes. Could have eradicated Krogan. Not difficult. Increased mutation to degrade genetic structure further. Chose not to. Ratni extinction tragic. Didn't want to repeat. All life precious. Universe demands diversity. I don't really think he's a heartless killer, but I'll just do that just because I want to see what he says. Pretty it up however you like. You're talking about murdering millions. No. Murdered no one. Altered fertility. Prevented fetal development of nervous system. Have killed many, Shepard. Many methods. Gunfire. Knives. Drugs. Tech attacks. Once with farming equipment, but not with medicine. <laughs> farming equipment. What was it like working on the Genophage Modification Project? Best years of my life. Wake up with ideas. Talk over breakfast. Experiments all morning. Statistical analysis in afternoon. Run new simulations during dinner. Set data runs to cook overnight. Laughter, ego, argument, passion, galaxy's biggest problem, massive resources thrown at us, got anything we wanted. Do you keep in touch with your old team members? No. All changed with deployment. Made test drop on isolated Krogan clan, hit rest of Tuchanka when results were positive. End of project. Separate ways. Watching it end, watching birth rates drop. Personal. Private. Not appropriate for team. Sounds like you were pretty important. How'd you go from that to running a clinic on Omega? Wanted to heal people. Good use of last decade. Something easy. No ethical concerns. Understand rationale for modified genophage. Right choice, still. Hard to sleep some nights. How can you agree with using the genophage, Morton? Look at what happened to Tuchanka as a result. The state of Tuchanka not due to genophage. Nuclear winter caused by Krogan before Salarians made first contact. Krogan choices. Refuse truce during Krogan rebellions. Expand after Rachni wars. Splinter after genophage. Genophage medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan, not Salarians, not me. So if the Krogan banded together and formed a united government, you'd welcome that? Yes. United Krogan saved galaxy. Destroyed Rachni. 
Genophage, not punishment, simply alters fertility to correct for removal from hostile environment. The effects on Tachanka are still your responsibility. You upgraded the virus that kept them in barbarism. Krogan committed war crimes, refused to negotiate. Turian defeat not complete. Krogan could have recovered, attacked again. Conventional war too risky. Krogan forces too strong. Genophage was only option. Krogan forced Genophage, us or them. No apologies for winning. Wouldn't have minded peaceful solution. How can you agree with using the Genophage more? Oh, what the what's stated to Chanka? Genophage bad. medical, not nuclear. No craters from virus. Damage caused by Krogan. Uh, We're not going to find mail and staring at consoles. Come on. All right. Well, let's have a look here. Another one. Dead Krogan, female. Tumors indicate experimentation. No restraint marks. Volunteer. Sterile, warlock, female. Willing to risk procedures. Hoped for cure. Pointless. Pointless waste of life. I didn't expect you to be disturbed by the sight of a dead Krogan. What? Why? Because of genophage work? Irrelevant. No. Causative. Never experimented on live Krogan. Never killed with medicine. Her death not my work. Only reaction to it. Goal was to stabilize population. Never wanted this. Can see it logically. But still unnecessary. Foolish. Waste of life. Hate to see it. I didn't think you'd had much direct contact with things like this. Did you come to Tachanka after dropping your plague? Yearly recon missions. Water, tissue samples. Ensure no mistakes. Superiors offered to carry it on. Refused. Need to see it in person. Need to look. Need to see. Accept it as necessary. See small picture. Remind myself why I run a clinic on Omega. Rest. Young mother, find your gods. Find someplace better. I didn't expect spirituality from you, Morton. Genophage modification project altered millions of lives, then saw results. Ego, humility, juxtaposition, frailty of life, size of universe. Explored religions after work completed. Different races, no answers. Many questions. Sounds like you were trying to deal with your guilty conscience. The doctor killed millions. Modified Genophage project great in scope, scientifically brilliant, but ethically difficult. Krogan reaction visceral, tragic, not guilty, but responsible. Trained as doctor, Genophage affects fertility, doesn't kill, still caused this. Hard to see big picture behind Isle of Corpses. Can you really just rationalize it all away? How do you justify it? Wheel of life, popular Solarian concept. Similar to human Hinduism in focus on reincarnation. Appealing to see life as endless. Fix mistakes in next life. Learn, adapt, improve. Refuse to believe life ends here. Too wasteful. Have more to offer. Mistakes to fix cannot end here. Could do so much more. Enough about your spiritual life. Anything useful on the body? Minimal insight into experiments. Gene therapy. Risking cancer, aiming for benign mutation. Krogan research is ruthless. Risking own clan's women for new data. Disgusting. Short-sighted. Wrong. It's hard to see all this, Morton, but you did the right thing. Your work saved lives. Not easy. Sometimes wish I wasn't as intelligent. Choice would have fallen on someone else. Not my problem. Fool's wish. Had to be me. Others might have gotten it wrong. Ready to go, Shepard. I mean, I like this stuff, because, like, you know, that's what they did, you know, they, uh, made, like, uh, like, a lot of the core part of this game, in my, in my opinion, is, like, the loyalty missions and, like, and all that kind of stuff. That's what people are saying as well. Like, the other shit doesn't matter. Like, the plant scanning, fuck it. You know? The, the, f fuck the Reapers. It's, uh, the characters they've made are actually, you know, pretty good in this game. They're pretty nice. So, it's just, it's, it's nice to see it. I actually like the... The, the hearing the the duality of like the this should come in handy. Krogan vitality. I like hearing the duality of like whatever they're you know, uh, like they're they're actually they're, they're actual characters you know, you know they're actually really nice. So anyways, right, so I think we're gonna end it up here, guys. So um, thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.